The real investment edge in today's AI-driven market isn't just about predicting which company will lead the charge in artificial intelligence. It's about identifying the industries being reshaped underneath the surface. While NVIDIA continues to break records thanks to demand for its AI chips, and Palantir cements its status as the go-to platform for AI deployment in highly regulated industries, there's another corner of the market heating up fast, and it might offer an even better asymmetric opportunity. That sector is cybersecurity. As AI adoption accelerates across industries, the volume of data being created, shared, and stored has exploded. But here's the twist. AI doesn't just generate opportunities, it multiplies vulnerabilities. As we move deeper into the generative AI era, the demand for more robust AI-native cybersecurity is becoming impossible to ignore, and investors who understand that shift early stand to benefit significantly. So why is cybersecurity becoming the next major AI investment frontier? The answer begins with scale. Every single day, the world now creates 0.4 zettabytes of data, that's four million times the size of Netflix's entire video library. Over half of that is video, followed by social media, gaming, web browsing, and messaging. Human communication has become overwhelmingly digital, and nearly all of it is vulnerable to attack. A trillion emails are sent every three days. A hundred billion text messages go out every four. And now AI can generate or manipulate all of it. Before generative AI took off, data creation was growing at around 24% annually. Post-AI, that rate is expected to exceed 36%. That's a 50% acceleration in the volume of data that must be monitored, secured, and protected. Not surprisingly, cyber threats are scaling in parallel. AI-generated phishing attempts have grown over 200% year over year, and AI-crafted phishing messages are over five times more successful than those written by humans. That's not just a statistic, it's a paradigm shift in digital risk. According to industry estimates, this dynamic alone could increase the damage caused by phishing by 60-fold. And it doesn't stop there. Ransomware attacks climbed by 84% in the last year. Encrypted threats surged by 92%. Cloud intrusions jumped 75%. Even DDoS attacks saw a 31% rise following the release of ChatGPT. The security landscape is evolving in real time, and traditional defenses aren't built for this kind of warfare. That's why top analysts, like Dan Ives, are now pointing towards cybersecurity stocks as the second derivatives of the AI boom. Companies that might not be powering AI directly, but are poised to benefit massively from its consequences. So, let's get into the names. Dan Ives recently spotlighted four major players, Zakala, CyberArk, CrowdStrike, and Palo Alto Networks. Each of these companies is dominant in its specific niche within the cybersecurity sector, and each one has built business models that thrive in an AI-heavy environment. Starting with Zakala, which takes a fundamentally different approach to cybersecurity. Rather than focusing on networks, Ziscala focuses on applications. Its zero-trust exchange operates like a global switchboard, connecting users directly to the services they need without ever touching the core network. This architecture completely changes how security is deployed. It's more scalable, less prone to compromise, and built for the cloud era. Scala now facilitates over 500 billion information transactions daily across more than 150 data centers. Their platform handles everything from URL filtering and malware detection to AI-specific threat isolation and decoy traps for malicious actors. They've also developed browser isolation for AI sessions, preventing sensitive data from being exposed during real-time interactions. Their financials back up the growth story. Revenue is growing at 24% year over year, with free cash flow margins at 28%. That gives them a rule of 40 score of 52, a healthy indicator of scalability. Zgala stock is up over 70% this year alone, reflecting investor confidence in their ability to secure the AI transition. Next up is CyberArk. While Ziscala focuses on application access, CyberArk is the undisputed leader in identity security. 
and in an AI-first world, securing identities, human and machine, is no longer optional. Right now, digital machines outnumber people in enterprise settings by more than 80 to 1, and that number is growing fast as AI agents become embedded in workflows. CyberArk's edge lies in privileged access management and AI-driven threat detection. Their platform can isolate risky sessions, monitor interactions between AI agents and sensitive data, and prevent unauthorized access in real time. They've also rolled out Cora AI, a machine learning engine that watches for secret leaks, credential misuse, and abnormal behavior across digital environments. Their financial metrics are impressive. Annual recurring revenue just crossed $1 billion, growing 50% year over year. Their rule of 40 score, a key SaaS metric combining growth and margin, is a massive 73. That means they're both scaling and profitable, and just like Scala, CyberArk is beating its own forecasts. Then we have CrowdStrike. If Scala owns the app layer and CyberArk owns identity, CrowdStrike owns the endpoint. Their Falcon platform protects the actual devices, laptops, phones, tablets, that connect to corporate systems. It includes cloud-native modules for antivirus, firewalls, and AI-enhanced threat detection. Their proprietary Threat Graph uses real-time data to track user device network interactions and flag anomalies before damage occurs. And just like Scala and CyberArk, CrowdStrike is leaning into AI. Their new security assistant, Charlotte, lets security teams use natural language to identify threats, conduct analysis, and take action without touching a single line of code. In an era where AI is creating more problems faster than humans can solve them, this kind of automation is key. CrowdStrike's latest earnings showed a 22% revenue increase and 80% subscription gross margins. With a consistent track record of beating expectations and maintaining leadership in the endpoint space, they remain a strong AI-adjacent bet. Finally, there's Palo Alto Networks. This company is essentially building the operating system for AI security infrastructure. Its core strength lies in platformization, consolidating multiple security tools into a single ecosystem. Their three main platforms, Strata, Prisma, and Cortex, work in tandem to offer full-spectrum protection across networks, cloud deployments, and security operations. Strata serves as the network foundation, providing AI-enhanced firewalls and predictive analytics that can automate incident responses before threats escalate. Prisma focuses on AI-native cloud protection, safeguarding containerized apps and infrastructure as code. Cortex is their most advanced tool, integrating extended detection and response systems with automation that cuts manual security tasks by up to 75%. It's also their fastest growing platform ever, recently surpassing $1 billion in cumulative bookings. Financially, Palo Alto is strong. Their next-gen security revenue has grown 34% year over year, exceeding guidance. Discounted cash flow estimates put their fair value at over $250 a share, suggesting more than 25% upside from current levels. Their integrated approach to AI security infrastructure puts them in a unique position as data volumes, attack vectors, and regulatory pressures all rise. Now, here's why all of this matters. Each of these four companies is a market leader in its own cybersecurity niche. By owning all of them, you're gaining diversified exposure to the most critical layers of AI infrastructure – network, cloud, identity, endpoint. Their business models are sticky, thanks to long-term subscriptions and deep enterprise integrations. And because switching cybersecurity providers is painful and expensive, their customer retention is high. Most importantly, the demand for their services is not just growing, it's accelerating. As AI gets embedded into every industry, from healthcare to finance to retail, the need for real-time scalable security will expand even faster. We're not just talking about bigger budgets. We're talking about new threats, new data types, and entire categories of compliance and regulation that didn't even exist five years ago. This is not a hype-driven narrative. It's the logical conclusion of AI's adoption curve. 
more data means more risk, and more risk means more spending on protection. And while the big names like NVIDIA and Microsoft get the spotlight, cybersecurity firms like these are quietly becoming some of the most important players in the AI economy. So if you're thinking about how to invest in AI beyond the usual suspects, consider the infrastructure that keeps the entire system safe. Scalar, CyberArk, CrowdStrike and Palo Alto Networks are not just great companies. They're critical assets in the digital future. Let me know in the comments which cybersecurity name you think has the best upside from here. Do you think identity, endpoint or cloud protection will matter more over the next five years? I'd love to hear your take.